Hello and welcome back to another Us vlog. Um, before we get into today's vlog, I just kind of wanted to draw attention to why we do these vlogs in the first place. And one of the main reasons to draw attention to any cause that we're a part of. Now at this moment in time, we're driving to raise as much money and awareness as possible for a young warrior called Desmina, who's suffering and fighting stage four neuroblastoma, which is a form of cancer. Now, what I wanted to kind of take the time to do through this vlog, you know, as an introduction to this vlog is basically um, kind of give you guys, if you've been following our story and following the us story, give you guys an update on uh, Desmina's condition. And I just received the email from Desmina's mother to say that, you know, she's she's doing well. Um, she's feeling a little bit weak. However, um, the cancer has spread to her bones and her bone marrows. So she's going to have to go through further surgery. Now, I kind of really wanted to kind of take this moment to really, you know, just let you guys know. First and foremost, thank you to everybody who's made a donation on our online donations page which is at www.johnnybangrally.com forward slash Desmina's Fund. And also anybody that's actually taken the time to purchase any one of our Kevin the Soul Assassin Ross signature line pieces of clothing because 100% of the profits from that clothing go to Desmina and her family. Now you can check out and feel free to purchase our clothing at www.johnnybangrally.com forward slash us, OSU dash lifestyle. And um, I really wanted to kind of put it out there and let you guys know and give you an update on her condition because I think it's imp important, more important now than ever to kind of drive to raise as much money as possible for this young warrior. So uh, please feel free. I've left the link on the, in the description below to our donations page and our online store. And also at the end of this vlog, you see, you see the links again flash up at the end of this vlog. So if you haven't already, please please um take the time to check out any one of those two pages and if you can please make a purchase or donation and we're going to keep on pushing through these means through these vlogs to you know raise awareness work with you guys and hopefully you know raise as much money as possible for desmina so um that being said um i hope you enjoyed today's vlogs remember please feel free to leave a comment in the description below um, we're all working together through these vlogs to also create a forum for health, vitality and a positive overstand us mindset. So I hope you enjoy it. Try life. Us. I swear a lot more because it has become communication. I do this for those who don't get it. I pray we will talk less and keep our promises. The hardest battles are given to the strongest soldiers. Alcohol and drugs get in the way of where your soul wants to go. I'm not old as fuck, young as shit. I have a fucking incentive. Most stuff people find important don't make sense to me. But my daughter not wanting me to be an angry soul does. Everything I have been through has got me to where I'm at. And to where I'm going. It's currently ooh, 12. Oh, I almost fell over. Currently 12:30 a.m. in London, England. I'm Benny, and welcome back to another US vlog. Now you may be wondering why I'm sitting in a van at 12:30 uh, a.m. and I'm kind of scratching my head and wondering why as well. However, this is the trials and tribulations of life. You never know what you're gonna end up doing. Now, what has happened is, if you don't know already, we run a young green coconut water based pancake business and fresh coconut water business called Us Coconuts. And what happens every week, we get a fresh shipment in of young green Costa Rican coconuts. However, the last kind of few days in London, England, they've been kind of, uh, it's been a very humid kind of warm weather and as a result of that there's been like a thunderstorm and what that has done is that's kind of created like rocky uncertainty 
in the sea. If that makes any sense. So, the shipment of coconuts from Costa Rica has been delayed. So, there are, there's, you know, there is, an, there's another supplier which happens to deliver uh, their coconuts to the market in East London. However, the market doesn't actually open until 12 o'clock at night. So I realized the mic actually wasn't on. Um, it's currently now 3.30 a.m. in the morning and what I wanted to kind of introduce you guys to or speak about or bring to awareness is the importance of kidney health and it's something that I've kind of been studying and looking into for the last couple of months and I kind of wanted to engage with you guys, give you some, some information that will hopefully help you and hopefully we can elaborate and kind of build on this discussion and keep on helping each other restore and generate and get to better health. Well, first I kind of want to kind of break down, hopefully you can actually see me. Um, actually, you know what? This will probably be a little bit better. Um, first, I kind of want to give you a breakdown on how or the function of your kidneys. And your kidneys are basically your filtration system. And it's where uh, you, a lot of you, the majority of your red blood cells are manufactured, and also it helps to distill or filter the cellular waste that comes from your red blood cells. So there's two kind of processes. I think I don't know the technical terms. You can do more Google research to find out everything, but I think your kidney is tied in linked to your, your your ureta, and that gets rid of the waste. But your kidney is also responsible for collecting anything that comes through there that your body can use for function. So it gets rid of the waste, filters out the waste, gets rid of it, and also collects all the sort of stuff that we need to help our bodies function properly. So one of the reasons I think the kidneys are kind of more and more, becoming more and more important in today's society as far as tied in and being kind of um, linked with your health is basically because of um, the environment that we're living in. Now this is because the air quality is getting a lot worse, um, the shelf life of foods has become a lot more important now because people, especially in the food or supermarket industries, want to stretch the yield of their produce, so they're spraying a lot more chemicals on our foods which we then have to ingest and try and get rid of which is taxing on our kidneys and our digestive system. So yeah, today's a new day basically. Um, last night I was down at the, 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 the fruit and veg market till the early hours of the morning. I got in a couple of hours, couple of, hours of sleep and I kind of just want to finish off that narrative that I got started on about uh, kidneys and kidney health. And what this vlog is basically is just an introduction to, you know, or an insight to how your kidneys work. And what I'm going to do is elaborate on this um, and give you some foods that will basically, I think, help to clean your kidneys and, you know, help them to function better. So we're gonna go through, in the next coming vlogs, we're gonna go through different types of foods that we can, you know, use and utilize to help our kidneys. Because at the end of the day, our kidneys, as I said, it manufactures our blood and our blood quality is one of the most important things within our anatomy. Because without blood, there's no life. So, um, yeah, man, um, what, what I'm going to do is I'm going to sign up now. Just before I go, actually, um, a guy called Jimmy Bray commented on the previous vlog and was like uh, talking about nettle tea. And I do know nettle tea is a great uh, blood purifier. It's great for asthma. And I'm going to be doing things in the subsequent uh, 
in the coming vlogs to basically show you how and where to find nettles and how to brew it and incorporate it into your diet because it's a thing that's a plant that's like freely available it's a weed basically and we're not utilizing these things that grow in our back gardens as much as we could be so i'm going to sign out now thank you very much jimmy bray for making that comment and i urge you guys to comment below and let us know what you think and how you know if you've got any ideas about or any any information that you feel would be valuable to everybody else out there about kidney health health nutrition vitality or general well-being and i'm gonna again urge you guys please feel free to check out our online uh store where 100 percent of the kevin the soul assassin ross signature line go to our young warrior desmina and also feel free to um check out our online donations page where you can make a donation directly to Desmond and hopefully we can all work together to drive to raise as much money and awareness as possible for this young warrior because she deserves a break. So right now, I'm at my, um, my friend Simon, aka Mr. Snappy's store. He just put in together like a little custom us piece. Let me know below whether this hat is a sink or swim, if you like it or not, um, because then I'll in incorporate it into our online store. So this is the fresh us trucker cap.